Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is Cheeseboy628 here today giving you another Team Building Tuesday. And I am not alone today for I have my buddy Ice. Yo, what's up? Not much, man. How are you doing? Good. Awesome. So what is it that we want to base our team on today? Doing Life Orb Greninja, right? Yeah. Awesome. Okay, cool. So, I don't have a ton of experience with using Greninja myself, but I do know it is quite the threat. There's a reason it's OU, especially for its standard Life Orb set. Now, I know lots of people run Hydro Pump. I don't know. Do you prefer Hydro Pump or Surf? I usually go with Surf. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, because it's only a little bit less power. And yeah, it attacks if, like, it was a double battle, it would attack both. Yeah. And a lot of people run Dark Pulse, but, like, I don't know if the coverage is, like, that great. I mean, what, it hit Ghost, Psychic, that's it, right? Yeah, I think. I, th I like the idea of running Grass Knot, and the idea of HP Fire. Yeah. I see gr extra sensory sometimes, but I don't really understand that. Um, but I don't know. I guess Dark Pulse is the best coverage in this case, so why not? So timid and max max. Got it. Okay. Cool. Now a poke you suggested yourself was. Talonflame, which is pretty awesome. It's the next part of a fire, water, grass core. And my favorite set is running Banded. And Gailwigs, of course. Brave Bird, Flare Blitz, U Turn. And then, as the final move, some people might run Return, some people might, I don't know. But personally, I run Sleep Talk. Mm. And some people are arguing that max HP is the best set for this thing. No. Max speed, adamant, is the best way to go. They just do that because like the amount of residual damage, but then Talonflame isn't as fast as you expect it to be, and it's not worth the argument. Alright, so obviously with these two relatively frail pokes, we're going to need a spinner. In which case, we can always pick Don Fan, because Don Fan not only resists the rocks, but it can spin and set up its own rocks. So, here we go, give it leftovers. It's gonna be our physical wall. We're gonna give it EQ, Rapid Spin, Stealth Rock, and Ice Shard. All right. And for some reason, they always suggest bulky physical sweeper. No idea why, but physical wall is the best way to go. All right, next we should fulfill the fire, water, grass core, and we should have Travenant. So personally, I run Chesto. Do you like Lum or Chesto better? Chesto. Cool. Yeah, that way you don't like use your berry too early. Now, are we running? What are we running on this thing? Horn Leech? Are we running Leech Seed, Shadow Claw? Mm, leech Seed. Alright. Leech Seed. Might as well have Shadow Claw for Dual Stab. But as for the rest of it, what else do you like running on this thing? Because I honestly haven't been using this too much, so. Oh, Willow, of course. And finally, do people run Substitute? I don't really know. Yeah. Alright, why not? I see it could get power up punch, it's kind of funny. But, yeah, we're just going to. We're going to go for Sub. Why not? Nice stall tactics. And we're going to make it specially defensive. And that's the core. It's kind of got an ice weakness, unfortunately. But let's see if we can make something 
else come in. Kind of eats that up. Uh, we don't have a steel type. Do you want to try B sharp? Yeah. Okay, cool. I mean, Grid Ninja, sure, it's part dark, but, like, obviously it can be any type it wants. So, I prefer Jolly Life Orb. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because some people say Adamant, but, like, it just doesn't give it enough speed, in my opinion. So, Sucker Punch, not Iron Defense, Iron Head. And knock off, of course. And swords dance. Some people run substitute, but I think it's just kind of wasteful because of life orb. Yeah. But yeah, cool. And then one final poke. It should probably be a special, especially offensive poke. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah. Definitely. Uh, have any suggest? Oh, we don't have a mega yet. Oh yeah, we we should use like Charizard because he like looks awesome. <laughs> okay, um, let's can we run Charizard X? Yeah. Okay, cool. So yeah, our team is definitely dependent on uh, Don Fan to come in, so we had to be careful about that. But other than that, we should be fine. Alright, sorry for the viewers if you sound like I'm sick for some reason. I'm starting to get a cold, but we're, we're going to get through this. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're going to DD Flare Blitz. Uh, Dragon Claw. And what do you want as the final move? EQ? Yeah. Cool. And they suggest out of it? I'm not too sure about that. Because Tough Claws plus base 130 attack is already super powerful. I'm gonna give it Jolly. Yeah. Cool. So, we built that team in seven and a half minutes. This is awesome. Alright. OU. I have to. Nope, that's not what I wanted. I'm gonna select the tier for this thing. It's based on Life of Greninja. And here we go. Alright, I'm looking for a battle. I'll let you know when I get one. Okay. I will have multiple tabs open because there's a battle I am recording after this, but uh. Yeah, let's see what happens. Hopefully I get a battle. Oh, I just realized we don't have Ice Beam on Greninja. That might hurt us a bit. So I'm going to change that now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to replace HP Fire, probably, because we already have two strong fire types. So I'm going to yeah. do that now. And cool. Now, he has Mega Lucario. GG. All right. Uh... Seems, oh, he has Ferrocent core. Good thing we have Talonflame, but the thing is, Swords Dance. Talonflame is what breaks that core. Are you. Uh, by the way, I have a battle. Yeah. Charizard can wreck most of his team. What's he gonna start with? Charizard X pretty much runs through his entire team. Wow. I don't want to start with the threat though. I'm going to start with Don Fan. Okay. Alright, this is good. Alright, he goes into Heatran. Interesting that he carries the balloon. Um, obviously offensive. I kind of want him to go for the rocks right now so I can rapid spin predicting. No! No, he burned me! Well, that really sucks, because Donphan's done. Wow. Are you even in the battle yet? No, I... Why aren't you in the battle? <laughs> How do I get in the battle? Oh, now I see it. Yeah. <laughs> um... This is... 
thing was even with me. Gotcha. I'm gonna go to Charizard X. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Turn off the sound, please. <laughs> okay, so this is what's gonna happen. I'm gonna Mega Evolve and I'm gonna Dragon Dance. And I might potentially just sweep this man's entire team right now. Oh, we're gonna get up your rocks. I really don't think he's going to have Roar. It does not make s <sighs> But he has Lava Plume. I have to go for EQ. I do not want him to roar me. Now if his guard chomp's scarfed, that's his only chance of winning right now. <laughs> Otherwise I almost have this in the bag. I don't know why he'd bring this in. Maybe he has Earthquake? I mean I'm gonna go for a Dragon Claw, try to do as much damage as possible. Does a decent amount, but Citrus Berry, what? Oh, and I live because I'm bulky. Yes. And now he dies. Unless he try. Oh, he's going in the Ferrothorn. Yup. Oh my gosh, that did a lot. Of course, it was a crit, but. Okay, so this is some. <sighs> I mean, as much as I want to bring in Don Fan right now, I can't because then he'll just go into Jelson and he'll get a ton of momentum. Mm. So I have to go into my B sharp, I think. But the thing is, that brings in a chance for him to go to Lucario. Mm -hmm. That's a decision. I'm going to have to go to B-sharp. And just press knockoff. Because I don't want this guy doing anything to me. Gosh, it's so powerful. Unfortunately, I lose half my health just from hitting him. But basically, Talonflame might have a chance of cleaning up here. Just maybe. Yeah. I have to go for the Iron Head here, though. Do as much damage as possible. Okay, mm -hmm. so he's special. I know he's special, at least. Um, he might carry Dark Pulse. I don't know. But I am especially defensive. So I'm pretty sure I can take one of whatever. I'm just going to leap seed. If he switches out, perfect. <laughs> I'll be nasty plots. That's fine though, because I do have the talent play. Yeah. Oh, I live too. I'm kind of surprised I did, but yeah, that's awesome that I did. I just realized we have Chesterberry and I don't have rest. Yeah. I'm going to switch that too. The viewers are probably like, geez, what are you doing? It's fine. I was wondering why I was having trouble finding a fourth move. But... Yeah, this Trevenant has no other use, so... Goodbye. Alright. So, basically... Only chance we have is Talonflame. Hopefully. Please. And we have even HP. Should probably switch that up. Yeah, give. Someone told me about that before. Oh, yeah, he goes in a Snorlax for whatever reason. But now he goes in the Jellison. I think we should. I mean, to be honest, it's over. Yeah. Green Mage, save the day. If only. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Maybe there's a chance, actually. It depends on how heavy Jellison is. Because... One second, please. Alright, basically my goal here is, I need to lose the dark typing, and then there's a chance that I can live a uh, vacuum wave from Lucario. So I'm going to go for the grass knot here, and hope to do- Oh, he just dies! Okay. Just don't bring in Garchomp. Don't bring in Garchomp. Yes! Okay, if this vacuum wave doesn't kill me, I win. No, not, that's not true. But, 
it does mean I have a chance. Oh, you did win. Now, what's funny is, if I had Ice Beam here, obviously would have won. But now it's going to be really, really close. This probably is Mega, too. So, oh, no, no, no. Okay, he's Scarfed. So that's that. I don't know what this guy is saying in the chat. Wow, that did literally nothing. But, uh... Alright, that wasn't too bad. Got a better chance than before, but... Alright, cool. So how about you get a battle? And just let me know when you get one. Is that it? No, this is the battle we were just in. Alright, cool. So you're looking for one? Yeah. Cool. I found out what he was speaking. What? H-A-U-S-A. -A. I have no idea what that is. Yeah, I I don't know. I wish I could okay, tell I'm you. Okay, I'm Alright, awesome. Alright, let's see here. Is this it? No, that still says Cheese Boy. Let's see here. Okay. Random battle. Why are you doing a random battle? Cause I clicked the wrong one. Okay. Uh, get it. Get an OU battle, please, with the team we made. Cause I don't want to leave it. Cause it's rated. Oh. That. All right. Let me know when you get an OU battle. Is there like no OU battles? There better be. Yeah. What's, then, what's your ranking on here? Uh. Um. um what would that tell me? Um, if you do slash rank in your username. Well, it's telling me I have not played any letters yet. Well, have you? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so maybe you put in... Here, hold on, I'll try it. Yeah, it says you have one... You've had one battle and random battle, and that's it. Hmm. That's weird. So to be fair though, it should mean that you get a battle pretty fast. Yeah. Alright, I'll pause the recording until you get one. Okay. okay, so after a tad bit of lagging, our buddy Ice here was able to get a battle. I'm gonna check this out. All right, so he's got an interesting team. Wait, why do you have Latios and Absol? We're, we're supposed to use the team we built. That's the team I clicked. No, the team we built. Yeah, I know. We never talked about Absol or Aegis Slash. I never... Dude, I am so sorry. <laughs> it's fine. Okay. Um. I, my, the same. Here. Uh, do you have the team built, or would you just want me to send it to you over? All right. After a little bit of time, our buddy Ice here was able to get battle. 
And so, let's check yeah. it out. The guy just forfeited. Alright. Well, I'll go get another one. I'm having the best of luck. Okay, yeah. I'm another one. Alright, perfect. Yeah, Please don't forfeit. forfeit. No. Uh, so... This is OU. He probably has his Mega Heracross. I have a feeling it's going to send up one of those water types. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, so I'm going to go with Trevor. Uh, I mean, he probably carries Ice Beam. I'd say probably start with Greninja. Go for Grass Knot as possible Politoed. Yeah. Cool. Uh, I guess the lag happened. Okay, the guy knows me. Potentially. Hey, cheese boy. Hi. Fairies. Fairy. What's good against fairy? Uh, steel and poison. Which oh. we have B sharp, but obviously can't bring it in on a potential hyper voice. So you yeah. can go for a leech seed. Oh, this guy is getting real greedy first turn. Okay. Uh, might as well go for a Shadow Claw Scout for how much damage it does. Uh, mm -hmm. did a decent amount. And now you should probably switch out. Uh, either Charizard or Talonflame. Talon? Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Jeez. Well now you press Brave Bird. And hope that you don't die recoil. I don't think you will. I hope I don't. Yeah, I'll probably live it a little. Okay, good. good. Alright, now what is he gonna bring? Okay, bring the Politoed. Um You don't really need this anymore. You could probably just press Brave Bird as much damage to this thing as possible. Oh, that is a lot of damage. Whoa. Okay, I'd say go into your Greninja. Because that's got to be offensive. Or at least specially defense. I don't know. Um, I'd say just press Surf here. Yeah. Alright, cool. So that thing is dead. What's he going to bring in? Uh, I have no idea. I hope he brings in the Zumaro. So hopefully a one hit kill. I don't, I don't think Rest that will kill, but it'll do a considerable chunk. He sent out Guard Chunk. Okay, Outrage will probably kill. I'd say going to Don Fan here. Well, we could use Ice Beam. I'm saying he's probably Scarfed, so he'll probably outspeed. It's not I'm really sick. worth the risk, so I'd say going to Don Fan. We do have physical wall for a reason, of course. Yep. Yeah. So now we can go for rocks. And he has no other option but to outrage. So we're in a pretty good position. Yeah. Everything's going to take some rocks damage. If he decides to bring in his fortress next, we can just bring in the Trevenant. And not really have worries. Yeah. So he is going to, I'd say, go for the Ice Shard now, because otherwise you're going to die from another Outrage. Does a decent amount. And now you can just bring in B-Sharp and press Knockoff. So, yep, he's, I mean, he's obligated to switch out. He's gotta be. And if he decides, I don't know what he's gonna bring in here, but knockoff plus Iron Head is going to do a lot to anything. So, let's see here. Let's go, Garchomp. He decides to stay in and crit you, of course. I mean, who wouldn't crit you? He doesn't have rough skin? What? You can't just have Sandvale and Tide Appeal use 
evasion. It's dumb. They need to ban that soon. Anyway, Aqua Jet is obvious. Uh, you don't really need this anymore. I'd say just Sucker Punch for damage. There's a decent amount. Okay, so you go down. Don't see his item. But, uh, you could probably go into Greninja and Grass Nut. It's probably your best play. It should kill. It's stab, super effective, life orb. Yeah. Zoom roll's kind of heavy, I'm guessing. Um, and then... Let's see. We have Charizard X for Fortress. And really, Heracross as well. It's going to be Mega. So I'd say just Surf here. And then see what he does. Because he's not going to take this Surf well. That's for sure. Yeah. So he's gonna. What? Why? I don't know. Nonetheless, press surf twice. Or maybe even thrice, depending on how much this fortress is going to take it. But, uh. Yeah, Careless is watching here. He's kind of confused about that aerial ace. I am too. I would definitely recommend Rock Blast, Bullet Seed, Pin Missile, Close Combat. I'm not much of a Swords Dance user. It's already Beast 185 attack, it's too much. So, come on now, bring in Fortress, please. So we can I get our next beast. Alright, cool. And so, Fortress is not gonna eat this up. Fortress has like what? Base 60 something special defense? I don't know, I'll check. There's base 140 defense, I know that. Yeah, and then 60 spadef. Which is nothing. Now please make a move, Fortress. So should we do sir? Yeah, definitely. Strongest hit and move. Yeah, he barely lives it. He has citrus berry, okay. Okay. One last press surf now, and that's GG. I'll look for a battle while you finish up there. Yeah. Now that's gonna be a GG. We both die. Yeah. Solid 2 0. Okay, I got a battle. Yeah. Everyone's using Snorlax. What is this? He's the new best Pokemon. It's gotta be. So he has three part dark types. Okay. I'm going to bring in Town Flame. Okay, he brings this in first. There's no way he's going to stay in, so I'm going to U turn on his T Tar switch. Okay, what are you. Do what? <laughs> what? That made zero sense. That made zero sense. What? What? Well, here's the thing. I don't know if he's sashed. I don't know what he is. I'm just gonna go for the ice shard. I don't wanna... Yeah, okay. Perfect. So this threat is gone. We're good here. So bring him to the light. It can taunt me. It can willow me. I don't want either of those. And so I'm gonna go into my talent flame once again. And I'm gonna press U-turn once again. Oh. Yep, Carlos is correct. It is in fact a team building dude. What's he gonna go for? I don't know. He's not gonna willow. Better not willow. Oh, uh, he might foul play actually. I'm gonna go in a Don fan. Yeah, he goes for foul play. That was a crit. Um, on the next hit, I'm going to go into Charizard here. And I realized, just realized, put zero IVs in pokes that, uh, that don't, that aren't specially oriented. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, cool. Uh, Greninja, and that's actually it. What? I'm smart. 
We have a ton of physical attackers. That's not that's not right. <laughs> uh, unless I'm going to go for a flare blitz here. Hopefully take him out. He taunts me. That's fine. Goodbye. See you next time. This team shouldn't be doing as well as it's doing. <laughs> um. Old Spice. Yeah. I'm just going to hopefully live in EQ if he carries it. Okay, he does that. Alright. To each their own, I guess. If he decides to stay in an EQ, I can come with Town Flame and then take him out. Okay. Or he could kill you. It's fine, we have the counter. Although, I think I'd rather bring in Don Fan. Because I don't want to bring Town Flame in after he brings in T-Tar, and that, that could just get nasty. So, Ice Shard, goodbye. We have some decent priority on this team, so that is definitely useful. Alright, there's no more use for this thing, so I'm totally fine with letting him die. Oh my gosh, that does so much, and we're defensive. I'm just going to EQ again in case he does anything sm crazy. Okay, we live anyway. Goodbye to Espeon. That's why I don't think Espeon is that strong, like, offensively. But then when you put it on a Baton Pass team, then it's just broken. Baton yeah. Pass, I'm always going to think Baton Pass is broken. Okay, I'm just going to get my rocks here. I don't really care. Now I'm going to bring in B-Sharp, and I'm going to go for a knockoff. Do a ton of damage. I have base 100 defense, so I should eat up anything he has. And, I don't... How does it live so well? Like, honestly. <laughs> like, we're talking about Life Orb, Knock Off, Max Attack, Fleece well, Lunch, Flinch. The of this yes. I mean, yeah. it's not affected by Dark Type. Yeah. So, mm. good thing I got the Flinch, otherwise this could have been pretty stally. Nonetheless, unless this is scarfed, I outspeed, and he's probably going to die. So, GG. Alright, to conclude this session, why don't you get one more battle? Okay. Found one. Sweet. Wow. Okay, he has the Smeargle. That's what I think. You should probably start with Talonflame. Yep, and I want you to U-turn into your Trevenant. And that should bring him down pretty low, or to his Sash. And now you can go to Trevenant and take a potential Spore. Yep. And now... You can either go for Leech Seed or... Yeah, Leech Seed's your only move to go here. Okay, he goes for Sticky Web. That's honestly not that big of a deal. He might bring in Talonflin. Okay, he just brings in Lucario. I say just go for the Willow. Because he can't kill you with anything, I don't think. Okay, yeah, he goes for the Swords of Dance. Please don't miss. Good. Okay, good. Um, you could go into Dawn Fan, but I'd prefer you probably to stay in because close combats are not going to be fun to take because he is neutral now. So I'd say just Leech Seed. Okay, he goes for Ice Punch. It honestly doesn't do that much. But you can't... St <sighs> You're going to die, unfortunately. But nothing, you can, nothing you can really do about it. So Trevenant just has to go down. Okay. Because you can't really bring in anything on an Ice Punch. Greninja could probably take it, but I mean, it's obviously offensive. Yeah. Alright, what you can do here is get up your rocks to put pressure on his Excadrill. Because he definitely needs rocks away for his team to work. And he doesn't have any hazards on his team besides whatever Smeargle is going for. And honestly, uh, we don't really care about hazards that much. I mean, it's the choice of spinning or getting up rocks, and I think rocks are going to be more important. Plus, you might be able to live two ice punches. Oh, 
or we could just load two close combats. I'm fine with that. Perfect, and you get HP from him, and then now you can go for a rapid spin, and he might die this turn. He just might. Nope. Oh. Well. Yeah. With okay, like you just you just made that the ideal situation for you. I don't know why he did that. Unless he brings in Rotom Wash and uh, Trevenant was the only thing to really take it. We don't really need Don Fan anymore, so you could pretty. Uh, but there's nothing we could really do to it. I guess you could Ice Shard. Because yeah, why not? could go into like Green Ninja and Grass Knot. No, Grass Knot won't do very much to Rotom. I thought Electric was weak against Grass. It is, but Rotom's really light. Oh. And Grass Knot is based on weight. So I'd say go into either Charizard. I don't think Charger because he'll die in one hit if he uses any water. No, I mean, when you Mega Evolve, you're part Dragon instead of part... Or, oh, yeah. Like, so you'll take it neutrally is what I'm trying to say. But I think B-Sharp is probably your better play. And you just go for the knockoff. Yeah. Still don't... This might be Resto Chesto. I don't know entirely yet. But... Maybe he's locked in the Hydro. Not really sure yet. Nonetheless, knockoff is definitely the best play. And he's going to bring in his Excadrill. Okay, that made no sense. Because now you press Sucker Punch. He just wasted his Excadrill. Otherwise, his Excadrill could have had a chance of doing saving his team, really. But he, he brought it right in. Okay, so he brings in his Talonflame. Um, I don't know if he's going to Flare Blitz or not, or he might just do Brave Bird for mind games, but I'd say to be safe, probably go for the Sucker Punch. Okay, cool. One hit kill. So he's going to go down. If he brings in Dragonite, I'd say just Iron Head, or no, just Knock Off. That way he could take off potentially Leftovers. You're probably going to Outspeed, because most Dragonites aren't jolly max special t er, max at speed so yeah you do a ton of damage right now he has weakness policy okay here I want it I want you to sucker punch but I'd say go for iron head instead because we can safely bring in talent flame after this and just brave bird okay or you just live good and we both die. yeah now you can bring in Greninja and press dark pulse And if he outspeeds, he's scarfed. Slash offensive. Okay, so he's offensive. He has to lock himself into Hydro. No biggie. Now he might actually kill because you changed typing, but okay, he just left. So, alright, good series of battles. Now it's time to review this team. Alright, so what did you like about this team? Well, the fact that I didn't lose, um... <laughs> <laughs> we, we lost our first battle. Oh, yeah. I forgot exactly what it was for. Hmm. Uh, it was just losing. Uh, I don't I don't know if the defensive core is doing enough work, to be honest. Uh, Don Fan takes hits, but not as well as it used to. Like, there's just too many threats in this tier now. And same for Trevenant. Like, I don't- Trevenant did very little work. Like, sure got Leech Seed and Burn Up, but, I don't know, it just never had a chance to rest, basically. Yeah. Charizard X was a threat to a lot of teams. I definitely enjoyed that. I don't know if we need Talonflame, because we already have be Charizard X being such a threat. Although the idea of priority is super good. It's our strongest form of priority, that's for sure. Greninja was definitely very useful. I can see why it's OU. Uh, B-Sharp did work. It was weaker than I thought it would, but it is jolly. But it still did work for sure. But looking at our defensive core, 
Um, one thing that I we had noticed is that Greninjas are only special attacking Pokemon. Yeah. And that is not necessarily a good thing. Um. So, basically, we're looking for something that could replace it. What could? Uh, hmm. I was thinking about Thunderous, but that would replace Talonflame, and I was thinking about like a Volt Turn kind of thing. So obviously that would be counterproductive. Um, what else works? <laughs> um, I don't know about Galvantula. I don't know, to be honest, I have a decent defensive core. Obviously the ice weakness, but still. Let's see, what what can't this this team had trouble that was it. It uh there's a lot of pressure on Don Fan. And basically we just kinda didn't play correctly around that team is all. There's just a lot of pressure on Don Fan for getting the spin-off, and when you have to face a Jellicent, it's just an annoying time, that is for sure. Uh, Ice Shard isn't as useful as it used to be. I was actually thinking about putting Toxic on Don Fan just to put a timer on that Jellicent. But... Huh. Oh no, I don't see, like, a huge problem besides the idea of not having another special attacker because there are a ton of sweepers in this tier that are threatening <laughs> um Gengar is not a special wall obviously but it's a ghosty it's another special attacker but then we have that lack of a special wall so all in all I, I'm gonna keep the team, unless you have uh, interjections, the team should be fine as is. Yeah, I think so too. Cool. Uh, what would you rate this team? On a scale of 1 to 10? Yeah. 6 or 7? Yeah, yeah, I'd say a 6. It, it worked, I'm just not sure how. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, you got anything else to say, Ice? Not really. Okay, cool. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, sub, and until later, peace.